What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Yellow Walkthrough right here on my Gym Leader Draven channel. Oh yes, we're back here again, and uh, as promised, I am going to show you the Mew glitch right here on my Pokemon Yellow. You know, how to legally catch Mew without any cheats or anything like that. Now back then, we all thought that an abandoned truck, and if you moved it with strength, would actually get you Mew. That turned out to be very false, but somebody else had found this glitch right here. This whole game is filled with glitches. And now, I'm going to actually show you how to do it. Now, if you remember, there are two trainers that I did not battle when I got here in Cerulean City. That happened to be the Bug Catcher and the Youngster with the Slow Poke. And so, those two Pokemon trainers are well needed for this, this whole glitch to work out. Now, what you need is a buttload of Pokeballs. Um, a Pokemon that knows Teleport. You also need... A eh, Pokemon that can actually uh, affect somebody's status, and then maybe one or two, maybe three Pokemon that are right around the levels of level 7 to 15, because Mew's at level 7, you probably want to weaken it, you don't want to take on his, your strongest Pokemon and just automatically faint, because, trust me guys, it's the only Pokemon you'll only have, or the only Mew you'll only have right here without cheating. So, what you gotta do right here is you gotta go down right below, and you gotta press the start button before that uh, trainer looks at you. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. Gonna go one and two. Alrighty, so we did it. He's looking at us. What you gotta do next is you gotta use that teleport. It's gonna warp you back to the uh, Pokemon Center. And as you can see, the glitch is activated right there as soon as he sees you. And he's moving us back. And luckily for us, we actually went to the uh, Cerulean City uh, uh, Pokemon Center. Oh man, you should have seen me the last time. I tried doing this before and it sent me all the way back to Vermilion City. Completely forgot about all that. So now what you gotta do is you gotta go back up and face the trainer or the youngster that has the slowpoke. So that's exactly what we're gonna be doing right here. Going left, going right. And uh, going this way, going my way, or the highway. This is taking a lot less longer. So as you can see, there's a youngster that we have not battled. One of the thing is, one of the things is that if you want to switch out Pokemon, you can't because once the glitch is activated, your select screen or your start uh, screen will not work until you have actually battled this guy. So what you got to do, follow the same pace as I'm doing. As you can see, he's looking at us. Dad took me on a great party at the SSN in Vermilion City. Hmm. All right, okay. Let's do this. Bring it on. The youngster wants the fight, and he's coming out with his slowpoke. Luckily for us, we got Sparky, the Spark Mouse, and we're going to be using a little bit of a Thunderbolt just, uh, just to make things uh, simple right here. Look at that! Alrighty, okay, finish that off, and that was easy. So simple. I'm glad I saved this for last, right? He's not mad. Yeah, you're mad. Kind of look mad. So what you're going to do next is you got to teleport all the way back, which. It's the Pokemon Center that we just we just used, and that's in Cerulean City. So it's not going to be as much right there. Now, once you do that, you got to go back all the way up to the Nugget Bridge. And before you even get to Nugget Bridge, your start screen will actually start right here. So here we go, up in Nugget Bridge. And as you can see, our start screen starts automatically. So that means that the, the glitch has been activated. So once you press the B button, you're going to be battling some Mews right here, so this is exactly what we're going to be doing right now. Three, two, one, go. You can see we activated it. And there's our good old friend Mew. Oh yes, Wild Mew, level 7. You Yes, you can capture this guy with a Pokeball. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to paralyze it and then let my other Pokemon take care of this whole thing right here. So he's paralyzed, may not attack. He's fully paralyzed. Okay, so... Let's go to Zubat right here. Oh yes, he's ready. And yes, he only knows Pound right for right now. So what I gotta do is I gotta actually... Well, it is weak to Bug-type Pokemon. Better not make it faint because it's gonna suck if it, if it, if it does. Alrighty, so here we go again. Okay, there better not be no critical hit because knowing my luck, it's gonna be a critical hit. So here we go again with another Leech Life. Alright. Huh. That pound attack is going to be working. Okay, one more. Come on, don't make it faint. Just put it on the red. Put it on the red. Yes, okay. So we're ready to get this guy going. 
We got a buttload of Pokeballs. So it's time to try and capture this guy right here. He's not going to be that easy to actually capture, guys. For me, it was... Uh, knowing my experience, there was only one time I actually captured it on the second Pokeball. And this guy is not going out without a fight right here. Come on. There we go. There we go. And we captured Mew. So there you go, guys. The Mew Glitch. New Poke uh, Dex added, and as you can see, number 151, the new species Pokemon. When viewed through a microscope, this Pokemon's short, fine, delicate, delicate hair can be seen. Wow. So, this guy is extremely rare. And no, we are not nicknaming him because, you know, he's not going to be part of our team. So let's go ahead and take a look at this guy right here. So here it is, Mew. Everything's evened up. 20, 19, 20, 19. Psychic type Pokemon only knows one move. Now the cool thing about Mew is this, that it, it's basically the original Pokemon other than Arceus. And it can actually learn every single move known to, you know, Pokemon. Every single move. Doesn't even matter if it's Guillotine, um, Splash, it doesn't even matter. It knows everything. So, if you guys want to have that on your team, by all means use it. But that is the way to capture a Mew in a without cheats, just with the glitch. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode when we go where to rocks. Oh yeah, to so we can go to rock tunnel. Yes, me babbling on and all that stuff. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.